Hey, Sean McGough here. I got my Don't Tread on Me Gadsden shirt. I couldn't find the flag. Got my American flag, my Marine Corps flag. Let me tell you something. They just let me out of the nut house for three weeks with the VA. They want to say I had religious, extreme religious osity. Give that Sergeant Morris a call. I ran into Morris. Well, I ran into Brian, who was the other part of the kids that saved me. He didn't even remember the story. And Mo remembered the story. Anyway, one day I'll make some dough and give them guys some good luck. That being said, I, run, I go down to my boobie's house today. Now she knows I've talked to Dave. I showed up and I tell her all these stories and she laughs her ass off and she says, God bless. And she wanna know how I am with my wife. Stop smoking the THC, this, that. I'm like, Berta, if I was smoking the THC, it's indica, it brings me down. My brain's flying right now, I told her, and I'm not swearing at you. I've learned to control it. What part of this don't you understand? If you people go all the way back to the beginning, I've told you so much shit and I got so much more. One lady lost six hours of video on her phone. I gave her my first autograph. I said, someone who come looking for that, it's worth $7 million. I didn't get the joke three months later they fired that goddamn Cuomo and his contract was $7 million. So CNN could go buy that goddamn autograph. I think I'm hilarious. God thinks I'm funny. Diablo, we piss him off. It's a long story. Yeah, I'm crazy as hell, but I just realized today, talking to Bubby, I had to explain it all again. I said, Bubby, I tell the same stories because I keep going back to Freud and Young and, and Jordan Peterson. I love those guys. And I go back to the Bible and all the other books and people are like, ah, oh, you're full of shit. You learn a few phrases. Yeah, that's right. That's all I can remember, but I can picture things and I... I'm driving along and I got pages flying in front of me and I'm, I, it's a joke with God. I almost crashed once because I was trying to read what the hell he's showing me and I yelled at him and swore and I'm not, if you could hear what's going on in my head right now, it's crazy. I know. But I said, uh, you know, Jesus Christ, you know, and then that kid comes out and I swear at him. I yell at him. Ah, it's a long story. I think it's hilarious. I'm learning not to swear when I do that, but it's the way I see God, the way I see the devil, the way I see and I'm telling you, I threw my life up to God. I realized today, all I have to do is say I'm crazy. And my wife will take me back in and she'll give me a little something, something for not making these videos. And she knows I talk to God. I think she believes me. But she says, just do it in mass. Can't you just go like all the Catholics and shut up? That's the problem with all of our religions. We just go and shut up. Joe Biden's last speech, if that doesn't scare every living American, Oh my God, we are a republic. Every voice gets heard. That's how a republic works. That's how those in the, the founding fathers with God, they found, they worked with the left, the right and the middle to come to the conclusion of their constitution. That's as binding as the Bible, folks. I'm through, I threw everything away in what I realized today. I'm sleeping at Bubby's for the weekend, but my wife let me do laundry at the house. I folded it. I took her stuff out. She didn't even yell at me for taking her stuff out of the dryer. I want to do her laundry and fold it for her and stuff and be nice. And I know the Giga Chad, whatever those fucking idiots, oh, excuse my French, God don't like you either. The Giga Chad dude, that freak with the beard that was on, uh, oh, what's the kid I like? Ah, it's all flying. I got 10 million jokes flying at me right now. I could do you four or five hours of stand-up. Maybe you hate it, maybe you like it. I don't know. But I'll forget about it tomorrow, and then I'll remember it three months from now, and I'll mix the jokes up. Because I talk to people, and I bring their stories along with me. It's a guardian angel thing. I'm telling you, I'm on my way to Maine for no ungodly reason except I got my flags, and I'm happy as hell. And that pisses me off, and people don't get it. When I'm happy and floating, and I feel free like this, and I'm giving God a hang loose because all the beauty that's in front of us... It makes me so angry because I can't give everyone around me that feeling. The feeling that God gives me. The belief in Jesus Christ. The belief in the Virgin Mary. I'm sorry. God showed himself. I told you. Go look at my confession. It's not good. I'm, I'm a bastard. I cheated on my wife. I did everything that you could do wrong in life. Except I tried to do my best. My uncle told me, do your best. I like amber liquids. Yeah, I like the weed. Not anymore. I take a couple puffs. I'm good. Brings me down. I'm up right now. If you can see what's going on, the swears, the, the control I'm using right now. Anybody who knows me knows I want to swear my ass off and just go to town and tell you 2,500. But I can bring it back down. That's what I tried to show the state police. 
I can go to a 14 and bring that down to a one. Yeah, I'm still taking the medication. I just realized that I had to pull over and take my meds. That's I pulled over for my medicine, not because I wanted to make this video. And, you know, the doctors couldn't figure out why the one medication... It's weird. My body's doing things. I don't know what the hell's going on. I didn't even work out, but I'm down lighter than when I got out of the Marine Corps, but I can't fit my blues. Oh, excuse me. I'm actually drinking coffee... I love these things. Anybody need a sponsor? Monster Java. Yeah, like I need more energy, right? <laughs> but they work when you're driving. And when you're with God, all things are possible. I'm telling you, folks, stand up. Love each other. Remember what we used to be. Your hatred for one man has made you insane. I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm a, I'm a politician. I want to at least, can we go to the first heartbeat? across the country can we come to some stop celebrating abortion like it's some um, rite of passage when you're, you're killing a baby i mean if i killed a shark i'm watching shark week and they tell me how four sharks in the bay in the shark's belly means that's a mommy but yet a baby in a woman's belly is a clump of cells in what world america this is this whole transgender thing started under money 70, 80 years ago. Do a deep dive into it. These people, have, they've been using your children. P big farmers screwed you on marijuana and they convinced Reagan, I told you all these things. I got receipts. If anyone cares to listen, it's gonna cost you a buck. <laughs> God's pissed, I'm always grifting. That's how we roll. I work for God. That was my point to this. My wife said, you know, if you stop this, you need to stop. I said, well, that's not gonna happen, honey. I love you, but I talked to God. I got the best job in the world. God puts his hand on my shoulder to lean on me. I'm not asking you to believe it. I know it. The shit I hear, I can't repeat it because I can't pronounce most of it. It'd have to be Jordan Peterson. And I am serious. I would love to be hypnotized by five or 10 or 15 people and see what the fuck, excuse me, what comes out of my mouth. I got no idea. I think it would be hilarious. God says, give it a shot. Diablo laughs his ass off. That's the voice I can't even describe. It's the most evil thing you ever heard. That's how I know him when he's around. He disguises his voice as God sometimes. Oh, that's Samuel Jackson. It wasn't his voice that I was hearing. God sucks at God. He likes Stephen Crowder. Because God sucks at impersonations. He was trying to impersonate my uncle. And he threw the swear in at the end. Because the only time I ever listened to my uncle is when he called me a mother effer. And he'd throw something at me. And that's why I like God throwing bricks at the, my id, my ego, and my super ego. Anyway, that being said, the um, effer part, Diablo took over. So, it, oh, oh shit, I got a state trooper here. Uh, I got to explain to him I'm talking to God. But I pulled over to take my medicine. I hope he believes me. Anyway, that being said, I got the best job on earth. I'm not giving it up, but I'm showing you, America, all of you, how to stand up and just be proud. It's amazing. Oh. <laughs> I just... Well, I was actually... I pulled over to take my medication because okay. uh, I'm... Bipolar schizophrenia. You know, my I'm filming this because I actually ten and two, and my registrations in there, and my licenses. In, this is how you're supposed to when the cops pull you over. What is See, no threats. Anyway, I'm sounds crazy. You believe in God? I loaded question. It's yep. There's something out there okay. for everybody. There you go. Anyway, can I put this without? I'm going to give you, I'm, this is what I'll do. I'm not high, I'm not drunk, I'm a little, I'm bipolar, so that's what the meds do is bring me back down. But I also, I'm going to give you an excuse you've never heard before, then you're going to want to let me go. If, if you don't, if you've heard this before, then you can arrest me. Deal? I don't know what, why am I arresting you? But what? It's a joke. Oh, I'm a comedian, I'm, I'm working, I'm sorry. Did I not explain that I'm a comedian and when I drive? I, I work out routines from my day. I call myself a guardian angel. I like to bring God to people. And 
I take their stories with me and then kind of the stories and they tell me a lot of personal stuff so I don't share that. Okay. But I manage, I always end up reminding somebody of somebody they know. Okay. And then I, it's like I feel their spirit. It's crazy as hell. I know it sounds nuts to you. I'm driving with God right now. I'm working on routines. You're part of the routine. What's your name? Zach Z Water. Zach? Zach? Yep. Oh, I was just talking about Giga Chad. That's a Giga Chad name. You know that, right? Zach? I have no idea. But you don't know? Anyway, I'm fine. I'm just... I'm so, oh, I went over 10 minutes. I'm trying to make all my videos 10 minutes because after 10 minutes, I'm wicked annoying. I know that too. Okay. But I'm okay. I'm, this is a... Uh, oh, here's an idea for you. Right, I, I, I don't want to sit here and just do a comedy bit with you. I'm just oh. making sure you're okay. Keep driving, okay? <laughs> yes, sir. Okay. Thank you. Have yeah. a good night. <laughs> you didn't let me get to the punchline about how I'm driving with God. That's pretty funny right there, ain't it? Have a great night, America. God bless. I was going to tell him to contact Sergeant Morris and the state police, but he didn't want to hear any more of my shit. <laughs> God bless. Welcome to my world. It's a ride. And I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Check out that Bryson Gray song. Misunderstood. That's me, baby.